So this is Kelpie Seaweed Ale, brewed with natural flavors. I bought this at Jungle Gyms because it sounded disgusting. Brewed and bottled in Scotland, 4.4% alcohol by volume. So yeah, we'll see what it tastes like. So I have no idea what to expect. So let's give this a shot. And yes, I'm using a steak and shake glass because why not? All right, this is gonna be interesting. I don't know, it smells like a regular beer. Woo, lightning. There's a second storm we're gonna be rolling through. So I'm hoping I have a better shot at getting a time lapse. I'm just in a really bad spot where I live. But I did take a time lapse earlier today. I could put that in this video. All right, Let's see what this tastes like. I am not a beer connoisseur. I just drink. It's, I don't know. I'm not getting a lot of flavor. I don't know, it's very, very plain, plain tasting. Yeah, very underwhelming, I don't know. There's like nothing to it. Yeah, this is a very, very boring beer. Its style is Scottish Groot and Ancient Herbed Ale. Whatever that means. I don't know. It's not a beer I would buy again, that's for sure. It doesn't taste bad, it just doesn't taste like anything. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, there you go. Don't waste your money on the beer. It's super plain to me. Alright, so when I say this, this beer doesn't taste good I was I just like gagged on it it's not very good <laughs> probably one of the worst beers I've had which is what I kind of expected it's kind of why I guess I bought this because it sounded disgusting and I am not enjoying this beer whatsoever there's just no flavor to it and it's got like a weird funky aftertaste but I guess that's why I bought it, because I figured it would be one of the worst beers I've ever had. Uh, nothing pleasant. Oh my gosh. And this is the only beer I've had today, so that's definitely not the reason for me to gag. And no, I did not have the camera rolling. I turned it off. Whew, man. Not good.
Like when I say I gagged, it almost came back up. Hey, yeah. But it did not. And I've never thrown up on the first beer either. It usually takes about more than I care to say. But I, that doesn't start happening until I get to the 14, 15 range. Then even then, uh, whiskey or liquor has to be involved for that to happen. Whew. Say, so if you're gagging on the first beer, it's not a good beer. Whew, I was hoping to get the reaction again, but it's not going to happen, I guess. There is actually one beer I've had that was worse than this. And I actually had to dump it out. It was a type of Guinness. I can't remember which one exactly. Like, I've had regular Guinness before out of, you know, draft. And that's really tasty. But I bought a Guinness out of a bottle similar to this. And I didn't, I had to dump it out. It was the nastiest thing I've uh, had. I mean, at least I can finish this beer. So that counts for something. But I won't go out of my way to have this beer again. That's for sure. Oh, there you have it. I wasn't planning on filming me finishing this, but... I guess I'm supposed to say subscribe. If you don't have a YouTube channel, create one and subscribe to me. And then talk to me. Because it's only going to be my family watching these videos anyways. So, I guess this will be a way for me to keep you updated and for me to say, hey, what's up? So, hopefully I can get my sisters on here. Hopefully I can actually... Do some filming with my sisters tonight. I don't know if that's going to happen, but uh, I shall see. So yeah, don't don't buy this beer. I saved you the trouble. Because I won't be buying this again. Alright, see ya.